SL Draftional Re-Review. Hey, what's up guys, it's Josh here. Today I wanna to do a little re-review on this FL Adraphanol. Now I tested this compound out quite a bit when I first got it, and then I kind of entered this period where I just for some reason didn't wanna take it. I was able to, as you guys know, find those modafinil analogs on eBay, and ever since then they were just head over heels better than this FL Adraphanol in every way. And I actually really liked FL Adraphanol right away. I couldn't imagine that I would come to the point that I'm at now to where I really don't like this substance. Then when I look about the pros and the cons that I have, I don't really see why I don't wanna take it so much but I don't wanna take it, I'm gonna be honest with you. So I'd probably wanna use it maybe at some point, maybe once a month if I didn't have access to the modafinil analogs on eBay. So the main thing that I don't like about this is the dullness and the tiredness. Now, when I first took this, it almost seemed like it was an anti-anxiety type effect. And I know that they did studies on modafinil, adrafinil, FL modafinil and FL adrafinil. And out of all four of those, the only ones that had um, anti-aggressive effects in animals was the FL adrafinil. Now, again, a lot of people would say, kind of argue with me when I say that there's fluorine in these things and people say that like, you know, it's not gonna act the typical way that fluorine does. But when you look at the symptoms of fluoride, it is being very dull, it is being very just bleh, you know what I mean? So it's weird that this has the most amount of fluorine in it, and then it makes you feel that dull, bleh feeling. Maybe it has nothing to do with it, I don't know. And then another reason I don't really like this is that it has to convert in your liver to modafinil. So instead of just putting the modafinil in your body and having it work right away, you have to take more of this, make your liver turn it into modafinil. So it's just making your liver work extra hard every time you take this when you wouldn't have to take it with the modafinil. And I don't know, there's just this weird overall dullness and tiredness. So I gotta be honest with you guys, I did a post, you probably have seen it, and I took 120 milligrams of FL adrafinil that day. Now, I was kind of scared to go more than that because my dosage in the past was about 90 milligrams. But when you do a little bit more research on it, it seems like the average go-to dose for effects of FL adrafinil is about 150 milligrams. And I never tried going up that high in the milligrams and maybe that would be better. I took the 90 milligrams yesterday and then like a week ago or so, I did the 120 milligrams. So when I took the 90 milligrams, I was almost kind of like, just tired. I almost didn't really notice almost any stimulation. Now, one thing that I'll say that I do like about this substance that I've noticed, I tend to be a little bit more productive. Again, I don't really feel like I'm taking anything. Most of the time I have to think, oh yeah, I ended up taking that or oh, I took that earlier because in my opinion, the modafinil that you feel combined with like the dullness, it kind of doesn't feel like too much of an energy burst for me but I was noticing that I was handling a lot of things that I needed to handle. There were certain things that I was kind of dreading a little bit, I didn't really want to do. And I was noticing that I would just kind of jump into them a little bit easier and kind of get them done while I was on the FL Adrafinol. But again, like if I were to really like ask myself, go really deep, do I feel 100% normal and myself? No, there was a little bit of something there, you know what I mean? So I really struggle, you know, if I really like this substance or I don't. Even when I was taking it yesterday, I was kind of dreading to take it. So I was almost a sign, like I almost didn't take it yesterday at 90 milligrams. Really the only big negative that I saw when I took the 90 milligrams is like, I just wanted that dull feeling to go away. I just wanted to feel awake and up and I couldn't get that. Maybe for other people it would provide some anti-anxiety effect, I don't know. I don't know how long Alcon Chem will continue to carry these modafinil analogs. So seeing as this is the only thing that we have available, and in my opinion, those modafinil analogs are just head over heels better in every single way, except they might be a tad more aggressive, but I don't get that much aggressiveness on modafinil. So anyways, guys, FL Adrafinil, 100% not for me. I really struggle with this compound. Again, I would use it maybe once or twice a month if I didn't have modafinil. But that's not the case. It's, it's really to the point where I could probably give this supplement away. Like I wasn't using it before. I was dreading to reuse it. 
it had some benefits at some point, but overall, I don't know. I just felt like it was a give and a take. Like the amount that it took for me is about the amount that it gave for me. So I'm about even. So it's like kind of like why take it? You know what I mean? But anyways, guys, let me know your experience with FL Adrafinil. Let me know your experiences with Modafinil and all the analogs. I'll be very interested to see. I've tried the Modafinil analogs on eBay so much. They're so easy to take. You could take a little bit. You could take a lot. I don't have very many issues with it. So. Anyways, guys, that's been my re-review of FL Adrafinil. It might be the last review. Thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate it so, so much. We're on the road to 50,000 subscribers, and I could not do it without any of you guys' help. You guys are the best. I'm having a great day out here. Hopefully, having a great day at home. See you all in the next video. Peace.